Prince Harry's shameful Nazi costume scandal recreated by the crown. Prince Harry's Nazi costume disgrace is the latest royal scandal to be recreated by Netflix's The Crown. The Duke of Sussex was 20 when he turned up to a fancy dress party in 2005, hosted by Olympic show jumper Richard Mead, dressed in a shirt bearing a swastika. He had arrived with his elder brother, Prince William, who reportedly dressed in a skin tie black leotard with a leopard skin pattern and matching tail and paws. Now, Netflix's royal drama has raked up the scandal for the second part of its final series. The last episodes of the show see the younger generation of royals, William, played by Ed McVeigh, his wife, Kate Middleton, played by Meg Bellamy, and Prince Harry, played by Luther Ford, takes center stage. They also feature on Prince Charles marrying Camilla Parker Bowles along with the planning of Queen Elizabeth's funeral arrangements as the monarch, played by Imelda Staunton, repairs to turn 80. Episode 10 of The Crown's sixth season, titled Sleep Deary Sleep, see Harry's Nazi costume scandal erupt. It shows him dressed in a rental Nazi costume for his child colonials and natives themed fancy dress party. After photos leaked from the event, the shamefaced royal ended up apologizing for what he would go on to call probably one of the biggest mistakes of his life. The Crown shows Harry with William and Kate trying on costumes at Gloucestershire Fancy Dress Emporium Cotswold Costumes. Pulling a beige jacket, complete with a controversial swastika armband off its hanger, Harry is seen saying, Germany had an empire, didn't they? What about this? A wary Kate tells him, I don't know, maybe cover the swastika? William argues, come on, wearing the outfit doesn't make him a Nazi. The trio then go to the heavily attended party where Harry wears another beige jacket over his costume. When he removes it on the dance floor, two other attendees spot the red-headed royal in the costume and take photos using a phone camera. 